Okay, so let's say that the government prints and spends money like there's no tomorrow, creating inflation and following in the footsteps of Venezuela, and you want to be able to throw the money in the trash in a very efficient way. Okay, so in this scene I have prepared here, as you can see there's this trash can, uh, there's these um, crumpled papers which I applied this money texture to, and, uh, and there's a sky, camera and a plane. All very simple. So if you want to throw this in the trash in a very efficient way, uh, all you need to do is uh, to create an emitter. Emitter, let me create this one. And now this emitter, usually it works like this. It just uh, shoots out all of these uh, particles here. But if I turn this around, and make it face this trash can. As you can see, it shoots now in this direction. So what you can do is you can take both of these spheres, which I created in another video, which is in, link is in the description. Uh, it's very important that these are different because then all of the paper, like balls are gonna be different. So what you can do is you can take both of these, you can search for this cloner and hold down Alt, Control Alt. And now it's gonna be apparent to both of them. So if you go in this cloner and change this to object and put this emitter in this uh, object tab here, as you can see, now these balls are flying out of this emitter. And now it's probably uh, a little hard to see, but all of these are different. Oh no, they are not different yet. They will be different when I change this to blend. Now all of them are different just because, well, it was, uh, I explained this in the other tutorial. So now all you have to do is add a rigid body tag to this cloner. And as you can see, they are already falling down. And if you add a collider tag to this plane and a collider tag to your trash can, you will see that they collide with them. Now, all you have to do now is to simply increase the speed of this until they, they hit this trash can in the right, um, in the right uh, spot, right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make this smaller and now I will increase this speed a little more, a little more. Actually, I think there's a small problem here, which usually happens uh, in these simulations. If you add a collider tag to your trash can, in this case, the shape will be automatic, which is bad because it creates... Uh, let me show you what it creates. I hope that I will be able to show you it. Um, it creates this collider and I think... No, it's uh, you can't see it right now, but it's... Um, the problem is that it's kind of crea created a lid here. And as you can see, these balls, they bounce off. And there's a very, very, very easy solution to that. You simply go in this collider tag and you change this to static mesh. And now, uh, as you can see, these dollar bills are, crumpled dollar bills are falling in this trash can. Of course you can, uh, uh, f uh, change the speed and size of this emitter so that these um, balls hit uh, this trash can uh, much more precisely, but that's up to you. Okay, thanks for watching and if you join in enjoyed this, if you liked something, if you didn't like something, please write a comment, please like, please subscribe and you know, go on with your life.